Hi Taurus, welcome to your love reading Taurus. Let's see what spirit wants you to know. Taurus, this is a collective love message for your sign. Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So please take what resonates and how it resonates for your overall situation, Taurus. Okay, let's see. What do we have for you, Taurus? What do we have for Taurus? We have searching, we have connections. Okay. What else we have for Taurus? Trust, criticism, harmony. There is a need of balance, Taurus, with regards to particular connection. I see. We have judgment. Okay. Let me take a look at this, Taurus. Is it your energy or someone's energy? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm getting Taurus that you uh, that we are connecting here with someone who you might felt that this person want, um, was keeping their options open. Okay, we have searching and connections. It's not one connection. It's connections, right? And I'm getting very strongly with the searching. It's like this person, you might felt that uh, they are still kind of looking here for it's like they are looking here for something um, for someone else it's not that for someone else but it's like this person is 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 keeping their options open and they made you feel that you are not um, they made you feel that you are an option not a priority mm -hmm. for some of you you might have um you might have caught this person being in touch with someone, you know, uh, or for instance, you caught this person texting someone else, sending messages, and that that's what kind of gave you this impression that oh, all right, this person is not fully uh, invested in me. They don't take this 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 connection seriously. Therefore, they're keeping their options open, and they still kind of it feels like they're still looking for something, even if they have. Uh, you know harmony and 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 happiness with me they are still kind of it's like not it's not it's not enough for this person we have trust criticism harmony and judgment yeah i feel this person betrayed your trust i feel also that you got lots of criticism from this person taurus it's like um th this is someone who might have a tendency to gaslight or they were gaslighting you and they were criticizing for some of you they might have even criticizing your your appearance or they made kind of unpleasant comments about something here and it's just it all and then you know it's just like everything kind of i don't know if it's like makes sense and then you why they would do that right because um what i mean is that ah okay so they're keeping their options open so they um, they know that they that I care for them, but they still criticize. They, you know, they criticize. They they are very critical of 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 my behavior or, or of my uh, appearance, or they're making these comments because they want to keep their options open. You know what I mean? That kind of thing, it's showing up here, and I feel that you know you have your reservations. That trust here, you know. It's not fully kind of, I feel that you don't trust this person. And with the judgment, it's like you're drawing certain judgment here about this person's behavior. And we have harmony. It might be a case for some of you tourists that you just want a harmonious, nice, pleasant connection. It, it, it shouldn't be that difficult. And again, this is someone I'm getting very strongly who who is keeping their options open or you might feel that they keep their options open because the way they conduct themselves because the way they 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 uh, they sometimes they are holding the conversation again i have this criticism very very strongly it's it's coming forward 
kind of unpleasant comments, um, criticizing uh, your views. It's, it's gaslighting. It's like making you feel down. And because of that impression, I feel that you just don't trust this person, Taurus. There is a need for harmony in this connection because it's getting too much. For some of you, it might have got too much and you, you kind of, you know, you are about to make a final decision with the judgment. Because I'm getting here, Taurus, that this person, it's not fully transparent. I mean, are they going to be that arrogant and, and just, you know, just be open that they have uh, other options here? For why, I, why I'm saying this is just coming through. Maybe for some of you, you, you dealt here with someone who has such a big ego and it's quite arrogant and... and and actually, they kind of showed you, you know, I'm so, you know, desirable by all this and look. And it just, I don't know why. It's just, it's, it's very odd energy. It's like searching for connections. This person is searching for connections. That can be your impression. Therefore, they make you feel that you are an option, not a priority, because they are still searching for connections, or they are still on a on a on a I don't know dating platform, right, or something like this, or you caught them texting, and trust here it's somehow broken. There is a need for harmony, balance, healing, honest conversation, f conversation that will bring something, you know, some sort of enlightenment. What to do next? But I'm getting that you are dealing here with someone uh, with the criticism who can use some sort of a manipulation, they gaslight you. Or they are very touchy. You can't criticize them. Because immediately they, they ego it's 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 Taking it in a very wrong way. Mm -hmm. This person has big ego, five of wands. Yeah, this is card of conflict, tension, argument. Yeah, we're starting this reading here, Taurus, from this from this card. Five of wands. We have an ace of wands. So very passionate energy. Fire. Could you please show us more for Taurus? Thank you. The tower. Mm hmm. Yeah. Argument. I'm getting argument, disagreement, very, very strong ex exchange of views with the Five of Wands tension. It feels like. For some of you, it, it might be, you know, you felt during this connection that it's like you have to walk on eggshells. This person can't stand or can't take criticism. But they don't have problem criticizing others. No, no. But if it's the other way around, mm, there is a problem. This is someone who, who thinks very highly of themselves. Quite arrogant energy, energy I'm getting here, Taurus. We have an Ace of Wands, so this is like an action. This is a very action-orientated card. And what happened? The Tower. This person caused the Tower moment. I feel that there was a very, very strong exchange of opinions. Argument. Disagreement. And Tower happened. And I feel it was provoked. Why I'm getting that it was provoked because we have an Ace of Wands and this is like a card of manifestation. Someone provoked, I feel this person provoked this argument. You might be dealing, Taurus, with Scorpio, Gemini, Aries. And we have the Lovers. Interesting. Four of Swords, they gave you a headache. 
Ace of Swords. There might it might be a no contact uh, situation between the two of you, Taurus. But communication is coming. Two of Swords. Are you fully open for this? Mm -hmm. Not quite sure. We have a side message. Page of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Eight of Wands, King of Cups and Seven of Cups. Yes, it feels like this person here is coming with some sort of form of an offer. Expect some sort of communication. They go. They they will try to be very charming, but this is someone who brings confusion. They, they, they confuse you. And again, Seven of Cups, we see the options. We do. This is someone who brought enormous amount of uh, confusion, mm, illusion, lack of clarity to this connection. And they made you feel that you are an option, not a priority with the Seven of Cups. This is someone who likes to keep their options open while they have one here with them. You might have been put in that position, Taurus. One more, please. Justice. You might be dealing with Libra. Mm -hmm. Six of Wands. Someone who loves attention. They like to be admired. Big ego big ego very very big ego but with this page of pentacles in the side message and knight of pentacles it, it just feels that they want to be seen as a king of cups king of love king queen please take it how it resonates male female it's an energy uh, but i i don't feel that this person has here much to offer i mean represented by the page of pentacles and knight of pentacles Mm -hmm. You have someone here who thinks very highly of themselves. Yeah, I feel that there was a disagreement, argument, and I feel it was provoked. It was done on purpose with the Ace of Wands. It's like triggering. You know what I mean? It's kind of like a, a comment here, there, and then suddenly it's just got too much. And there was some sort of argument here, a disagreement, or very, very, very passionate exchange of opinions. It caused the tower moment. We have the lovers. For some of you, you found out here that this person indeed is in touch with someone else. With the lovers. And they, of course, I'm getting very strongly that they said, what are you talking about? Of course not. No, it's not true. You are imagining it, it yourself. With the Four of Swords, I feel that there is a no contact situation. This person here wants to talk. But what I'm seeing here also, Taurus, that's with the two of, so two of Swords, you are blocking. You are blocking. You are protecting your heart space. And it might be a case that you block this person because it was the right thing to do with the justice. It got too much. It got too much. Five of Wands, Ace of Swords. The tower, justice, too much. Too much. This person's going to receive their karma. The tower with the justice, ace of swords, that's like a justice here. I'm seeing you taking a step back, trying to be more balanced. Also, you know, in order to recharge your batteries because I'm getting very draining energy here from this person or the whole situation has been very draining and with the tower it's it's like you know it never really had a chance to blossom into something beautiful because at the very beginning this person built this connection on 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 something that um, affected the stability of it therefore for some of you indeed they were searching for other connections. Okay, let's see how this, this person's feelings for you. Taurus. Could you please show 
us this person's feelings towards Taurus yeah they want to they want to talk they want to send you a message to Taurus they want to take an action they feel very passionate about this about you as well of cups as a side message four of cups the death card knight of wands this person is very inconsistent childish in and out knight of wands can also represent that kind of you know peter pan a, a bit of a player energy yeah they, they, they i mean why would you act in that way when you have a ten of cups with someone i just don't understand this and this person had a ten of cups with you a potential for happily ever after love understanding but you, we are connecting here with someone who i feel within time started acting like a brat with, with the four of cups nothing was good enough nothing it's good enough you should do this you should do that you should change this and whatever you might have decided you know whatever you tried to do and how many times and no, you know how many times you tried to offer this cup of love to them support them show them affection that you are there for them uh -uh. nothing was good enough for them therefore tower moment happened and we have that this situation you know ended while well, they're coming back Taurus with the knight of wands you see take this knight of wands is rushing into this because they want to talk about the situation you might be dealing with Scorpio but to have this and act like this I mean, the spirit kind of made a stand and said, enough, it's enough. Taurus here have be, been through a lot. There is a need for a huge change or just, you know, certain things will, will just come to an end with regards to this connection. They want to talk about it, about this, this situation here, Taurus. They do. Could you please show me this person's feelings towards Taurus? World. For some of you, there is a distance, like a physical distance between the two of you. Maybe this is someone who is from a different country, city, um, from a different um, state, province. It's like a travel here. Eight of Wands to the world. What else, please? This person's feelings towards Taurus. We have an Eight of Cups. Mm hmm. They want to talk. This is someone who doesn't want to let you go. And they feel that you might be walking away because the situation no longer makes you happy with the Eight of Cups. They are coming. They want, com they, they want to talk to you, Taurus. This is someone who is very passionate about you. But deeply inside they know that they messed things up. And with the Eight of Cups, they feeling you leaving them behind. They feel it deeply inside. They know. With the world... Yes, this is someone who feels that y you indeed might kind of, you know, at the end, you, you might be reaching a point that there is a, the best solution here for your well-being and just for you is to close this chapter, to close this cycle and to accept the situation for what it is and to just, you know, to let go of it. 
and they feel unfinished business they feel they don't want this Taurus they want to communicate because if someone feels that it's it's over then they don't have eight of wands in their feelings because it's 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 an urge to talk to communicate they want to talk I'm getting very strongly for a lot of you that the situation ended something here ended between the two of you okay this connection or you know you are just now there is a no contact situation with the four of swords and they want to talk they want to talk about this ending about this tower moment about this death card that we had in the side message they want to talk about it and they are rushing in they feel this urge deeply inside in their heart this passion to come forward and talk to you about it but this is someone who has a tendency to be very detached it's like they're creating ba boundaries it's like they are unreachable with the world they are there whereas they can sit next they can you know they can be sitting next to you you know what i mean someone who is not fully present but this is someone who feels that you might be leaving them behind closing this cycle therefore they are rushing in to talk to be in touch because they don't want this to end no you might be dealing taurus with another taurus aquarius a scorpio or leo okay let's see how this person sees you Could you please show me how this person sees Taurus? How this person sees Taurus, please. We have a three of swords. Mm -hmm. How this person sees Taurus? Ten of Wands, Six of Swords and Three of Cups. This person knows and they are perfectly aware that they broke your heart. They see you as someone who've been through a lot with the Three of Swords. There was... A, you've been through a lot. With the Ten of Wands, It feels Taurus that it, this person, this person knows that you have so that you might have a lot on your plate, you know. And they still cause you this emotional upheaval. And with the Ten of Wands, their perception is that you are very near to drop this burden caused by the Three of Swords. And you're going to detached. With the six of swords again you this person sees you slowly moving away leaving problems and this heartache this disappointment in love behind behind you you're leaving it behind you are moving very slowly towards karma times that will bring so much happiness and joy this person is aware Taurus this person is aware that's their perception here that's their perception of you that yes they caused emo they caused you emotional upheaval with the three of swords there is a pain emotional pain sadness tears it's a heartbreak and breakup and it was heavily heavily burdening you and this person is aware that they caused that sort of that they caused you this feeling of 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 burden of of this of this emotional upheaval but they seeing you slowly moving on leaving them behind leaving this burden of this emotional upheaval caused by them you're moving away from it and you are heading here towards happiness and joy this person this person feels that it can be too late that's why they want to rush in because they can feel it mm -hmm. that's why they want to talk because Taurus is moving 
Taurus wants harmony. Ta Taurus wants peaceful energy. Taurus wants equal give take. Taurus wants Taurus wants to be happy. That's how they see it. And I feel that's the truth. You want harmonious, happy relationship and you're moving towards karma times. Attracting so much happiness and joy. Because this is a card of pure joy, celebration, happiness, fulfillment. Look how different this energy from this energy. You are leaving this behind. This person, this person here, Taurus, is perfectly aware that very soon you will drop this burden that they caused. That they caused you. That you are very, very soon, just one more push, you will drop the burden that's been heavily, heavily weighting on your shoulder on your shoulders and um, you will move towards happiness let's see let's see this person their perception is that you that you want to detach that you want to detach you you you, that, that you don't want to any longer be in this in this in this energy of of disappointment and dissatisfaction yeah this person fits yeah nine of swords they are losing sleep over it this person kind of sees you that's their perception that you just want to detach from them that's for some of you, of course. It won't resonate with all of you. But enough, it's, you know, like, it's, it, you just have enough. Could you please show me the outcome? Could you please show me the outcome? We have a seven of swords. Could you please show me the outcome with regards to this situation? We have a page of swords. We have the hermit. We have a two of pentacles. Okay. What we have at the bottom of the deck, we have an eight of pentacles. For some of you, this is someone from your workplace or someone, con you know, from your work-related environment. Doesn't have to be. Seven of swords with the page of swords. Yes, this is the, the outcome here. Is to, is that this person uh, is planning how to s sneak him back? I don't know if if, the, is, if it's the right way to say to sneak back into your life with the seven of swords page of swords they are spying on you and they will continue spying on you if you have social media they are checking your profile they are checking uh what's going on in your life what you're liking what sort of pictures you might be posting what's going on are they trying to gain some sort of information you see this hermit here look how she's looking at into this uh i feel it's like a computer laptop right spying spying Oh, let's see what Taurus is doing. Mm -hmm. With the two of pentacles, I see them still thinking how to approach you, what to do. This is someone who feels uh, instability with regards to this, 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 this situation. They are unsure what's going to happen. Mm -hmm. And, you know, they cost this. They cost this. Eight of pentacles. I see you minding your own business for 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 now you know you might be just you know focusing on yourself for some of you are, you are focusing on your stability work career money you know you have goal in mind i feel also Taurus, that you are kind of distracting yourself for some of you of course in know in order to not think about the situation i completely understand you therefore you might be working harder you know or not harder it's like you're working more you know but if for the immediate future i don't see this person making any moves no they do want to approach you they want to talk they want to reach out it might be a case stories that they will reach out but as an overall outcome nothing here is you know there is no kind of progress Because this is a passive energy in an outcome. 
it's like they will try to sneak in this is like a spying energy spying energy just just spying on you checking what's going on or trying to gain some sort of information what's going on in your life mm-hmm and two of pentacles don't know what to do should i do this should i do that that kind of energy <laughs> it might be a case stories for some of you that this person tried to reach out but you blocked them with the two of swords that we have you blocked them because it was the right thing to do enough it's enough but this is someone in their feelings who doesn't want to give up who wants to um, approach you who wants to reach out and they feel that you are leaving them behind and that's what's truly it's bothering this person but with regards to four days to you know seven days i don't see here um, like a significant change when it comes to this connection now i see this person spying on you and still trying to figure out how to approach you or what to do next because it might be a case that they've already approached you or they will talk but it won't bring desired results you know desiring it it won't bring uh, the results that they truly were counting on <laughs> okay therefore they will still continue spying on you please take it how it resonates we have so many messages here but um yeah i don't see any significant change when it comes to four to to seven days more four days but deeply inside they do want to talk they want to talk and they don't don't want this 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 connection or you kind of leave them behind taurus i have strong virgo as well <laughs> Taurus, you might be dealing with Virgo. Taurus, I will leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly appreciate you. Taurus, have a fantastic and wonderful day. And once again, thank you very, very much for being with me. Take care. Bye.